let's take a look at how your development process would change if you were to introduce testing earlier. Think back to our opening example. One of the main factors that led to your project to be less than satisfactory was the lack of time you ended up with for testing and fixing bugs. The market you're working in is very competitive and there was a lot of pressure on your team to deliver perfect results quickly. Your team needed to design and build the product extremely fast, but that high speed came with demands and risks that weren't properly planned for or accommodated in advance. You ended up having to trade quality for speed, which isn't the outcome your team would have liked to have provided to your customer. So how can you take steps to ensure that this doesn't happen in the future? First, think about your current development method. Traditional systems are very linear, not allowing for a lot of deviation from the set schedule. And because your development system is linear, you had a hard time adapting to the changes that you needed to make when you discovered the extra bugs in your product. There wasn't any time allowed in the schedule for reworking aspects of the product. And because of that, you weren't able to build the product that would completely satisfy your customer.